clear as a fish. What's going on guys? We are back here at a familiar place. Kind of familiar actually, I've only fished here once. But we're back at Lake Monona here in Madison, Wisconsin. We've got the kayak and we've got all our fishing stuff in the trunk. So let's get it ready to go and let's get fishing. I usually pack pretty light. But we're only taking one rod with us. This is my medium heavy with a chatterbait tied on from the last video. So hopefully we can catch some fish today. All right guys, we've got the kayak all ready to go. I think we have everything we need. If not, we're just screwed. Anyways, we're gonna get out in the water and see if we can hook in anything. It's a beautiful day here. We've got some pretty calm water, the sun's shining, not too much clouds today. Let's stop wasting time and let's get out on the water. We're just gonna cover a lot of water today. It's looking like a great day for fishing. I'm thinking the fish are gonna respond pretty good to this chatterbait and just find out where they are. There's a fish. I was just cranking it in. fish guys I'm happy with that okay pounds 3.83 there he is he's not over four very close to four pounds what a beautiful large mouth he crushed that chatterbait There he goes. Now that was a good fish. Trailer's still looking good. But I was literally just like cranking that thing as fast as I could. I was just trying to crank it through the weeds and he destroyed it. Another healthy, beautiful largemouth bass. He's not huge. We'll just let him go. You ready, dude? Back to the depths. Fish number two. I'm happy with it. Wasn't as big as the first one, but he was still not tiny. I don't know if we can make it under here. Again.
good thing the seat reclines. Yeah, you see that? We're gonna make it. Bass. He's a pretty one. Yeah, he doesn't have much of a lateral line. But another beautiful fish at that. Wow. Alright. You ready to go back, dude? Back to the depths with you. Okay, I was kind of expecting something to be hanging out over here in this shaded area. He wasn't huge, but I will take anything. If you enjoy fishing adventures and fishing tips, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And also, if you haven't seen this video yet, I highly recommend you watch it because we caught tons of pike in it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next fishing adventure.